Most of you have heard the word caliber in the context of guns, for example a 44 Magnum or this paint gun here is a 68 caliber. But what is a caliber actually? The word caliber is not a number. It is a length. It's a special length. I'm gonna show you. This special length of course is measured and then that measurement produces a number. But caliber has a couple of synonyms. It is first off its length if you like English that would be an English equivalent. Oh by the way because all these weapons and weapons technology and the invention of gunpowder is coming from the East the word caliber probably well, I'm not spelling it in Arabic because that's Latin alphabet but it's an Arabic word meaning mold, the mold used for casting, that's uh, Kalib and it has to do with casting bullets or projectiles so it's a length and it's a and it comes from the east and comes from Arabic and it's a special length it is a diameter it's the diameter of the projectile I don't have a projectile for the paint gun with me but a diameter is a length just in case you want to uh, argue it ferociously we'll pretend that's a circle a diameter is a length going from one side of the circle to the other side of the circle it's a line segment and this line segment also going through the middle of the circle has a finite precise length okay so a caliber is, a, is the length or diameter of the projectile that fits the gun barrel let me see which one is shorter yes and you measure it with a measuring instrument uh, coincidentally called caliper this, this caliper is spelled with a P here alright and uh, this diameter can be measured in metric in millimeters just about like so and then you have a measurement there you can set it to inches and there's your 68 caliber there close enough now it's a little bigger than 68 it's 69 there if I hold it almost 69 there because you have a little clearance between the projectile and the inside diameter of the of the gun barrel you need that little clearance so that's what a caliber is it can be measured in metric or in imperial like a 9 millimeter caliber or this one was the 68 68 caliber there's also a decimal dot there and that's interesting because when it's in metric I'm just gonna go M for metric so if you say for example 9 millimeter you have a number and you have a unit of measurement but when it's not metric when it's inch based you can just say the number 44 caliber well 44 what? it is 0 0.44 and it's inches 0 0.44 inches so it's decimal inches okay there are fractions and there are decimals and 0 0.44 would be I'm just gonna open the jaws on the caliper to about 0 0.44 there it's really finicky okay that's close enough we'll pretend it's close enough if, if you want to see what it is in a fraction there it's 7 16th of an inch that's 11 millimeters and there we toggled back to decimal inches that's there 0 0.44 is about 7 16th of an inch so there's fraction and there is decimal inch so that's what I wanted to say about calibers usually the zero and the point is not pronounced when it's an inch based measurement you just say 44 caliber or 68 caliber